Hi everyone, I hope you are having great day today and welcome back to my new video. On this tutorial I'm gonna show you, Scarlet is live now. You can install IPF files with Scarlet again with the new anti-revoke. As you know, lately it is very difficult to install Scarlet on iPhone because of the revoked and blacklist device issues such as unable to verify. To solve this problem, I have found some solutions to overcome the revoke on this Scarlet. I have updated my website and tried some DNS to overcome the revoke on Scarlet, and here is the tutorial. Please visit this website. This website is what I created, and I combined some Scarlet installation links along with its DNS. Please follow, like this video. First, you can choose which DNS you want to use. My suggestion is to use the DNS from the top first. Click the DNS link and click Allow. To install DNS Profile, go to Settings. Click Profile Downloaded. Input the passcode. Then install the DNS Anti-Revoke for Scarlet. Make sure you have installed the DNS Profile like this video. If you are using VPN and other DNS, please turn it off in the DNS menu in Settings. Then check the DNS Profile for Anti-Revoke Scarlet. After all is OK, please return to the Scarlet install page. Then select one of the Scarlet links. I will try to install the Scarlet link from above first. If this Scarlet link fails and cannot be installed, then continue to the next link. Click this link and you will redirect to new page. Click download and install Scarlet. If you see unable to install on Scarlet, it means this link not working on your device. So you have to select the Scarlet with the another link. Please note, the way this DNS works is to bypass the revoked Scarlet certificate, so you have to try the Scarlet link one by one until the Scarlet is successfully installed. If you find a message like untrusted developer, it means that Scarlet has been successfully bypassed by the DNS. Please verify in settings, general, VPN and device management then click Trust on Scarlet. Please remember which certificate you have verified because you need the certificate name that you will later import into Scarlet. Now open Scarlet. Go to Sideload menu on the bottom. Then click and hold this button and click Manage Cert. In this step, you have to download the certificate file on the Scarlet page. Make sure the certificate you download is the same as the Scarlet certificate you verified earlier. You can see the certificate password on the Scarlet page. Please copy it, then enter the password later when you import the certificate. Download the certificate. Then go to the files application and unzip the certificate file. Then reopen the Scarlet app and import the certificate you downloaded. Select the certificate file then import the P12 file and mobile provision file into Scarlet. After that, enter the password you copied earlier. And now Scarlet can be used to install the IP of file you want. Enter the sideload menu, then press this button without holding it. Then select the IP of file you want to install. Then Scarlet will install the IP automatically. And the application installed by Scarlet is successfully opened without revoke. For more information, I will give tips on how not to get revoke with this DNS. If you want to restart your device, make sure cellular data and Wi-Fi are disabled. Because if your data is active, DNS will be paused and the Apple server will revoke the Scarlet application that you have installed. And also make sure you do not uninstall the DNS that has been installed. Second information. If you can't install Scarlet with this DNS and always unable to install, it means your device has been blacklisted. You can try to erase your device or factory reset your device. You can follow this method by watching this video. Okay, thanks for watching this video. Please leave your comment if you need a help. See you on the next video.